this is my Indiegogo campaign sign up page for the comic that I'm working on, Eugene Alien Warrior. 52 pages of color comic book science fiction adventure. So the link is in the description. So please go there and sign up for uh, future updates. It will be done soon, I hope. Only thing left is the coloring of the last uh, 24 pages. So um, go there and sign up. Thank you. Hello, comics fans. I'm here at the Annandale Firehouse for the monthly comic book show, and the parking lot is packed with people. So interested to see how many there are inside. I'm uh, not here looking for anything in particular, maybe some X-Men issues and back issue Spider-Man, but that's about it. Just kind of want to show you what the monthly show is about. It's $3 to get in, so they don't really hit you up for a big fee. So let's go in and check it out. It is a lot of Avengers. Uh, we went only, so this is all new stuff for us this week, and okay. we only did Marvels other than the slaps. Okay, cool. And you gotta also get the Harvey 15 cent price range. They weren't, they weren't very long on their 15 cents? They, uh, they, they were, they were so ones they were on the sale in England. Oh, really? 15, 15 cent heights. Something with the currency exchange. 15 pence or 15 cents? Oh, yeah. I don't know how popular just curious, what's your 100 going for? Spider Man 100? So if we do one seven, one seventy. Yeah, 
Okay, come on. He's like, wait, I'm missing you. Wait, you got that, you got that, you got that. Right <laughs> Someone even said, I'm, I'm in the low 20s. I go, oh yeah, right here, 22, graded, 75. He's like, oh wow. And then he got that. <laughs> so, you know, um, uh, I just have to look. This one literally just came in. Well, I'm Steve, by the way. How you doing? I'm fine. Hey, Bob. Good news. 241 is the one that multiple people looked at, I can tell you that price. <laughs> <laughs> Only because multiple people are looking at it. This seller here always has all the great books. They're a little high usually for me, but I mean, just so much, so many classics and just bangers. Sports cards on the other side. But you know, thankfully there's enough books out there where I buy for fifty and I don't. What goes around comes around. Yeah, you can't you can't win every deal. Well, you can. You can freak yourself. Nice shirt. How are you doing, sir? Nice shirt. Thank you. <laughs> you as well. <laughs> Thanks. What? For you or for resale? Or resale. Yeah, yeah, I don't. I mean, I see so much. Yeah. <laughs> 
either. <laughs> <laughs> So, I just got back from the comic book show, and I just wanted to share you my pickups uh, that I got there. Got my uh, new Transformers uh, t-shirt that I got off of eBay, um, so I was sporting that today. But I was mainly looking for um, X-Men issues 212 and 213, and I picked these up from two different dealers at the show. Um, the first dealer that I went to, um, he had both issues, but he wanted $220 for both of the issues. They were bagged and boarded, not graded, probably about a 8.0, uh, maybe a 9. Um, but I went on Go Collect and looked there, and even for a high graded slab, I don't think it was even uh, $60. Uh, for just uh, issue 212. So he said um, that he would do it for $200 after a 20% discount. Now it's like, nah, because I've been seeing um, prices on eBay even for these issues at like 15 bucks, uh, even for um, near mint copies. So, and sometimes like $24. Now for issue 212 at the second dealer that I went to, because the first one didn't have uh, 212, but for this one, you can see the price tag on there too right there, but it's uh, $30. Uh, so I got this one for that, and it's a good copy. I would still say from just looking at it, rudimentary, like a nine. And I also picked up from him, he had like a, other boxes with cheaper comics. So I picked up issue of New Mutants, issue 39. And then on the back, he was like doing double on his, it was uh, issue 40. And this was $3 um, for this one. So I ended up getting both of these. He just charged me like, what was it? $32? I can't remember if I picked up anything else from him. But no, I think that's I think that's it. And the first dealer that I went to, he had issue 213. And this is a beautiful looking book. And this was $25 uh, for this issue, which is about on the higher end, well, yeah, on the higher end of what I saw on um, eBay for this book, but uh, I need it for my X-Men collection to kind of fill a gap. I was looking for issue 210 too, but I didn't uh, uh, see that there, so I'll look at that, look for that at the next show or look for it online. Um, now the other things that I got was uh, just a few uh, Iron Man issues. I do like older Iron Man. Um, I guess classic Iron Man. So I got issue number 98. And these are all from the same dealer. And this was $10. So this has like Sunfire in it. So, I mean, that's always cool. I like that character. And then I got uh, issue 151 and 154 here, and this one was uh, $3. And it's got Iron Man, um, Ant-Man in it. And this one is 154, and it has the unicorn. And I just like that, uh, like that cover, very dynamic. 
uh, makes you want to pick it up and see what happens on the inside, which is what a good cover should do. Uh, so yeah, that was my pickups from the day at the comic book show. Uh, like I said, they do it uh, every month. They have another one uh, in Fredericksburg, uh, Maryland, which I think is a bigger show, but it's kind of far for me to drive. But yeah, that's it. So please um, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and help me get to 500 subscribers if I can. And uh, thanks for watching. Coming soon, my comic book project, Eugene Alien Warrior, a science fiction based comic of action and adventure. So please like, click and subscribe to the channel for comic book news and updates. Thanks.